15 universities, 7 destinations, 1 mission. This is the Amazing Network Movement. Morning. 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 Morning, guys. Morning. Hey, good morning. I want to ask you guys a question. Do you think which team will be eliminated? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Oh, that's a tough choice. Uh, I, I'm not sure because all the team is amazing. Is so good. Team masing-masing pun ada dia punya kelebihan masing-masing Ada kuat masing-masing So macam macam ni ada Ada daripada bawah pump naik kan So kita boleh naik aspek benda tu So benda ni tengok nasib lah so, Today is like uh, Using transportation So Masa They don't have regulation So there's There's a disadvantage GMI 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 <laughs> GMI No no we, we don't yeah, want to tell We don't want to tell We, we want to show an action You uh, know it yeah. today yeah. We'll fight for KDU. Of course, Gemma will be in the final. M. <laughs> It's a beautiful day, located at Bus Express, booth to obtain your ticket in a field with a lots of friends. Today is the semi final day already. The last 18 that makes it today will make it to the semi final in the convention center. The, today, all the teams are getting way too smart and way too intelligent to locate the net pass booth. They're all following us. We have to do some trick today to make sure it's a lot more difficult for them to find. You guys, massa, massa, massa. Look for the iconic spot in Langkawi. We are going to find the eagle. Eagle, eagle. Where's your member? You have to wait for your oh. all your all of your keys. Oh, then only you can open your envelope and read it out loud. Of your rented car and number eight, the side enterprise to wait. Of the your rented car number eight, the ready car enterprise to wait. One December counter six for you to get some. Have to look for the rented car. Do you do? Off in your rated car at number 8, Zuna ID class and depress towards Towards Nakawi punya ni Cable car Target lah Oh, very heavy oh, I'm dying In this next challenge, team need to come to this counter and claim their cars and drive all the way to the last pit stop of the semi-final itself 
but there is a problem. Team Masa, they did not bring their driving license and also Team Taruk, due to safety reasons, they could not drive the car. That instantly put them in the bottom two positions. <laughs> Oh, so tired. 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 Oh, Bagi cabaran kita itu hujan. Roti kita kanan. Roti siapa tengok map? Please please please. Ah satu point tiga kilo ini. So we are using three GPS. Semi final bro. Semi final. Mana? Tadi bang ke mana? Hanya hanya hanya. Hopefully, I can reach more faster than other team now because I don't want to limit by today. Yeah. Okay. We are rushing. Tanjung already. Wait, dear. Got that all done. Wait, away from our car. Go, go, go. We are not driving because we are long time here on the road already, so it's quite dangerous for us to drive. So we have to make sure. Teams have to take one of the skycap to go through two platforms in one of the most beautiful Langkawi skycap and there they will actually find the last pit stop. Kami dah sampai skycap. Kami boleh terlambat lagi. So sekarang let's go. Semua ni ada yang dua tahun jing ni. Let's go. I want to buy the tickets to go up. You have your wallet? No. I think you took my card. No! Guys, why are you going? Why? Six days, six cities. You've traveled more than 2,000 kilometers. Yeah. Team KUPTM, welcome to Langkawi Sky Cable. You're the first team to arrive. Team IUMW. Yes. Your team number two. Yeah. Team MMU. Yeah. You're the third team to arrive. Yes. Yeah. Yes. We are from here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Huh. We done, man. We made it. Quite the end. Quite the end. Your team number four. Yeah. Your team number five. Yeah. You guys are team number six. Oh. Your team number seven. Taro. Yes. Yeah. You are team number eight. Yes. You're the second last team to arrive. <laughs> you guys are the last team to arrive. Tell me what happened. <laughs> we we entered the wrong location. Yeah. <laughs> and no one has license here. It's quite sad to say that uh, the instruction has been given quite clear. Yeah. yeah. During the boot camp that you have to bring your driver's license. Huh. But the good news is it's not over yet. Yeah. We are going to proceed to play Netview. You still have a chance. You need to fight hard and hustle hard to try to come back out. Okay. Yeah. Alright guys, okay, let's proceed to the next one. Okay. okay.
Hi guys, thank you so much for watching Amazing Network Movement. Think you guys are actually good enough to play the game? So click the link down below and download this particular game, Network, in your Play Store or App Store. And do remember, we have our first cash competition happening in 1st of November. Click in, join into the cash competition. I will see you guys there. Are you guys ready to play the final net wheel? Yeah! Okay. Rich people are often blank and take calculated risks. So what is a blank? Financial minded. Financial minded investing? People are often budgeting. Both of you guys got the answer wrong. So I'm going to open the floor for more chance. <laughs> Both your answer is also wrong. So I'm going to give chance again. <laughs> Here's the correct answer. Rich people are often creative and they take calculated risks. He got the right answer. Rich people do not think inside the box. Most of the time they think out of the box. They are very, very creative people. So that's why I chose this question. Can someone explain to me what you understand as the meaning of blue ocean strategy? With lowest cost, I can get more benefits. Dunia, eh? Gurak pada ombak uh, currency atas atau ombak currency bawah. Both answer is wrong. Cost to open a new market and create a new demand. So Ocean is creating a new market with a low cost to expand their demand. The world is moving towards a blue ocean strategy. You create a new market space. You add some creative idea into it so that you are the only one in the new market space. You don't compete with the rest. The opposite of blue ocean strategy is red ocean strategy. You open restaurant, I open restaurant. You open hardware shop, I open hardware shop. The only way to compete with you is slash price. Hence the word red ocean strategy is blurred. So blue ocean strategy, an example, Uber or Grab car, they created new market space. Before that, it was all taxi. Both of these guys got remnants of some correct points and uh, I will give it to uh, Team YPC. Yeah! 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 What alphabet would you like to choose? Hi, hi. Next question. According to Kiyosaki, why is it that rich keep getting richer and the poor keep getting poorer? Because uh, rich uh, keep asset while poor keep liabilities. Both your answer is not correct. The poor people, they did not invest in asset. Rich people has the financial knowledge and motivation. It's just specifically not the one I'm looking for. The rich guy would use their money to buy assets. Since young, they learn about like, um, the knowledge from the book in the school, but not about the financial literacy. The rich keep getting richer and the poor keep getting poorer simply because the subject of money is not taught in school. Yeah, it's taught at home rather than in school. Okay, so I'll give it to her. Thank you guys. Oh. 50% have to minus 50%. Do you think that making more money will make you rich and why? Paper scissors rock. Paper scissors rock. Memang betul kita boleh dapat kerja yang lebih tinggi lebih bagus daripada yang lebih tinggi akan dapat kerja yang bagus betul tapi kita perlukan sesuatu untuk invest untuk masa depan kita contoh seperti aset mungkin satu hari nanti tempat pembangunan dan harga rumah tu akan naik so itu adalah duit kita harga kita okey gaji tak semestinya gaji kita tahun tu kita akan tukar kerja sebagai jawatan itu next question work to what don't work for money Work to learn. Is entitlement mentality for poor people or for rich people and why? Entitlement mentality is actually for the poor people. Only the poor people will think that the world owes them something. Orang kaya dia tidak punya pemikiran seperti itu. Mereka berusaha sendiri untuk mencari duit itu di mana dan mengambil risiko sendiri. Tapi poor people ni dia terlalu bergantung. Ambil jalan selamat. Mereka tidak mau guna jalan risiko. Ambil inisiatif sendiri. Financial freedom is our aim. Yeah! Team YPC, congratulations. Your guess the key one correctly. Let's give up again, guys. I'm very, very sorry to say to Team Masa, you guys play so hard. And you guys did very, very well. I hope that this entire amazing network movement experience is going to be a positive experience for all of you guys.
my respect for you guys. Yeah, yeah thank yeah. you so much. You cannot get any more dramatic than this. I thought Amazing Network Open will create a lot of rivalry among people. But uh, what I see here, no, they created even closer bond with each other. That is amazing, amazing network movement. I'm not at Gunting Highland, I'm not at Cameron Highlands, I'm at Langkawi Sky Bridge here. Wow, isn't this beautiful? Wow, very nice, very nice. Saya belajar daripada race ni sepanjang enam hari uh, friendship, teamwork, persaingan tu ada. Tapi even kita lain you, still tolong satu sama lain. Tu tu friendship yang kita orang nak. Bila nampak tim masa yang nak tersingkir tadi kita orang rasa macam kita orang patut ah uh, bagi dia orang dan kita orang patut fokus kat kita orang punya final. And lagi pun masa layak untuk ke final. First, saya memang tak pandai manage money Sangat-sangat boros Kalau dapat duit memang terus habis So daripada sini dapat belajar lah Macam mana nak manage money tu untuk simpan Untuk masa de guna masa depan This whole one week was, was like a game changer for me And I never thought that all of us get to know each other so well Because this is a competition One team will be like, you know, rivaling with another team But if you can see, like all of us is like one family we from UTMKL want to wish you guys all the best in the semi-final and make it to the finals you guys we thought we will go back home today sleep tomorrow I have to go to the yeah. class but I don't know UTM, yeah, UTM, UTM miracle can happened. change it miracle happened I feel we're not good enough to replace them but at the same time we want to stay a very thank you to them I actually felt quite sad. The reason why we are lost because we are actually not good enough to compete with UTM. But because UTM has something they need to focus on, they give us a chance again. Also, we also want to keep playing in this game. So, thank you UTM. They have surrendered their spot. I really appreciate it. Thank you UTM. Again, to be given to these guys. Oh my God. Guys, finally we finish the semi-final of Amazing Network Movement. Woo! Congratulations, guys! Woo! So we have a lot of stress today, but I'm glad that it's all over already. So I want you guys to uh, share with me what have you learned today on the semi-final uh, net view. Uh, what I learned is I learned a different new thing, which is blue ocean. Mm -hmm. I never heard that word before, mm -hmm. and it is about uh, creating new market mm -hmm. and. Uh, 
creating new demand mm. for other companies. So that's what I meant. Yeah. 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 The thing that I learned the most from the net view section is that um, financial freedom is uh, our view, is our goal, is our aim, right? Yeah. In life. Yeah. So um, through this uh, net view, when I get back to uh, my home, I think that uh, my primary aim for future will be absolute financial freedom. Today I learned about entitlement mentality is that uh, entitlement mentality is for poor people mm -hmm. which they think that the government owns them which means that they didn't work for the money itself mm -hmm. so it's not really a good thinking. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Today I learned a lot and one of it is uh, the way the rich people get getting richer is the way they teach the financial management like a family, right? family rich people Mm -hmm. They teach they financial they literacy teach at home. financial to their son so they can mm -hmm. learn how to make an investment and how to make a passive, more passive income. Mm. Yeah. And that, it's that. really taught in school, right? Uh, yes. The school didn't teach about the mm. financial management because it's very important to mm. nowadays. For what I learned today, actually, it's like we have to be brave to take the risk in invest in everything mm -hmm. so that we don't like uh, think of too much of thing like if I go and invest will it be feel it won't make you successful thank you thank you let's give him a big hand wow today but really was very tiring yeah mm. I was I think we're mm. only 20 minutes ahead of you I really pity the last two teams because the last two teams yeah. one team doesn't have license another team because of safety reason we cannot allow them to drive so no choice, we have our crew to drive them and they become the last two. I thought I created this race. It's going to be a lot of competition, competing spirit, everybody want to kill each other, that kind of thing, right? Oh, the oh, last oh. thing oh, I've no. never expected is this uh, amazing network movement actually bring people closer to each other. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's that's an amazing, that's an amazing feeling. Friendship important than yeah. the, the compet competition. Another thing I, I'm even more proud of is this. The, the team is a Malay team, all Malay was uh, giving their spot, their position because of the exam to the last team and the last team is truly Malaysia we have a Sabahan, Malay, Chinese, Indian yeah. 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 it's truly one Malaysia so it's an all Malay team being the big person giving to the one Malaysia team yeah. you know, so that's amazing, that's amazing let's give them a big hand, yeah. huh? let's give them a big hand respect, respect, respect truly, uh, I couldn't ask for a better semi-final and today it was just very surprising yeah, I want to thank all of you guys uh, from the bottom of my heart for playing full out. Alright guys, um, I think uh, that's a wrap for today. Yeah. Yeah! 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 Hi guys, thank you so much for watching Amazing Network Movement. A movement towards making gamification university happen. After all the research and study has shown, we believe that games is the best way to educate the next generation itself. Either games in physical form or games in app game form. That will be the best combination to teach our next generation. Now, if you'd like to partner with us, do send us an email on networkfeedback at gmail.com and we will reply you very, very soon. Ministry of Education Malaysia, we need your support. Do send us the email and we will partner with you very, very soon. Thank you. Congratulations, you guys did well today. And now, I'm going to hand out the final clue on how to be from a semi-finalist to a finalist. All eight teams will be invited back to the convention center. The top four teams that manage to sell the highest amount of convention ticket will be the top four finalists. So good luck and out you go, guys. Guys, I've got news for all of you. One of the team has committed a technical breach of the rules. As a result, they have been eliminated from the game. You are now being invited back to the race.